Hey guys, it's Fantasy Simmer, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 Twisted Life Part 4. And Aspen already went to work, so yeah. <laughs> she leaves for work pretty early in the morning, so she's already gone, and um, Jada is just waking up, I believe. Yeah. So we are going to take care of her, and then I don't know what we're going to do with our day, but we shall see. <laughs> so I'm going to have her just get ready. <laughs> All right. Go on. Okay. And then after she does that, I'm going to have her come over here and have some brunch. And we will have... Let's just do a BLT. I feel like she'd be a BLT kind of girl. <laughs> oh, yeah. And thank you guys so much for 21,000 subscribers. Um, I just hit 20K like a week ago and now I already gained a thousand more. That's honestly so amazing. Like I can't even believe that. <laughs> I was like, whoa, like it's going up so fast. Like how is this happening? And I was like so excited. So yeah, I'm so grateful for all of you and I will continue to thank you every single time I hit another thousand because I just feel the need to. I don't want to just, you know, act like it's nothing. As, you know, my channel grows more and more, I still want to, you know, you know, acknowledge every time I hit another thousand. Because it means a lot to me. Alright, so I'm going to speed this up. And now it's just how, okay, she can still have a BLT. Because it switched to lunch. Because it is noon now. She kind of slept in, but that's what she does. She stays up late, she sleeps in, she gets into fights. <laughs> Alright. So, in the last part, um, we had Aspen um, meet some guys, and I'm thinking of maybe having her go over there and kind of meeting them as well, and it would be kind of funny if she kind of got along with the same guy and that caused a bunch of drama, um, but the guy, like, truly see, see her being with in the end is the guy that, like, I don't know, he had, like, more hair. I don't know who he was, but he had, like, wavyish hair. And, like, I believe he was wearing, like, a plaid shirt, I think. I don't remember what his name was. But we'll go see. We'll go over there and see if anyone's home. And, yeah. All right, so she's just about to finish eating. And then, oh, my God, dirty again. What? Okay, go take a quick shower again. Girl, what are you doing? <laughs> Getting dirty so fast. All right. Okay, I'm going to have her get out, and then we are going to travel. Okay. Alrighty. So, um, where did they live again? Yeah, right here. Yeah, he was wearing plaid, and then his hair is, like, wavy. Not, like, long, but longer than the other guys. Alright, so let's go there. was hoping to have my kitten in here while I record and you guys might have heard her meow and stuff. She's so cute. <laughs> but she's in the dining room sleeping on a chair <laughs> and she's like passed out. So I didn't want to disturb her. Most of you guys probably know I got a new kitten and you guys think she's so cute and I'm like spamming you guys with like videos of her and like pictures on Instagram. So sorry about that, but <laughs> all right. So, she's going to go talk to this guy first because, you know, I mean, this is the guy I see her being with most, but she might try to, you know, flirt with him and try to make Aspen kind of mad, so. But we are going to, you know, get to know him a little bit first. This is the only guy where she's like, hey, I'm going to actually be nice to him. So, we're going to do a heartfelt compliment because, you know, and compliment his outfit because he's, she sees he has tattoos and kind of has, like, her type of style. And she likes that. Um, we're going to discuss interests and get to know him a little bit, um, tell a dramatic story, tell a funny story, and ask him about his day. Alright, then after that, I'm going to have her go over here and talk to the guy that Aspen kind of likes. Well, do they have a romantic bar yet? don't remember. 
No, they do not. But they were, like, getting along well, and I can really see them probably, you know, having some feelings for each other. And he's just, like, naked, practically, almost. <laughs> She's just, like, all the more reasons to mess up things. Because he's just standing there. Oh, he's leaving. Okay, well, that sucks. And she has work in an hour. That also sucks. Can we still, like, try to talk to him? Will he stop for us? Let's try to go see if he will. Oh, he's actually gonna let us talk. Okay, cool, cool. I thought he was like headed to work or something, but I guess not. All right, so we are going to um, debate game strategy. Right off the bat, just bring up games. Does he like that? I don't know. Discuss latest games. We're gonna try to flirt with him like already. We're gonna ask him if he's single. Um, he, she's embarrassed. We're gonna do a pickup line. I don't know if he's gonna like us. But if not, we're just gonna try to bug him. <laughs> oh. Okay. Screw you then. <laughs> okay. Now we're going to jeer. We're gonna be rude now because like, uh. <laughs> Um, we're gonna mock his outfit because we don't like it. We're going to yell at him. And we're being like, hey, we were going to flirt with you, and you know, but you weren't feeling it. And you were just, you know, kind of being like, nope, I don't like you. You're not cute. You're not my taste. But, you know, you could have got some kisses going on, but nope. And where is she going? Oh, go to work. Okay, yeah, you do that. And we are going to bring Aspen here. All right. So he's now angry. And then wait, 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 wait. Do, do, do. Okay. We're going to try to calm him down because, you know, she's the good one. Okay. Is she going to work? Like actually, actually going to work? There we go. Okay. I believe that's only her second day of work. So I didn't want to um, her to miss it already. Okay. So we're going to brighten his day. And, um, apologize to him for, I don't really know what, but we're gonna do it. We didn't do anything, but I don't know. Um, friendly. Get to know. Um, compliment outfit. He's self-assured. Express admiration. I'm gonna see some funny stuff. Do a knock-knock joke. Um, do a funny story. Tell a funny story. Um, joke about engineers. And do an impression. Okay, I'm going to speed that up. Does he like offensive conversation? Like, he doesn't like us. Maybe, like, this isn't going to be good. I don't know. Or maybe it's just because, like, he, he's mad. I don't know. So, this is not working. Like, he hates us. Like, does he think we're Aspen? Or we are Aspen. Does he think we're Jada? Because, or, like, doesn't like us because we're Jada's friend? Like, this was going so well before. This is a complete fail. Or maybe it's just because he's mad, though. I don't know. Okay, let's go inside. And let's chat with this dude. The other dude that, you know, looks like maybe he'd be good for her. Let's ask about his day. Because, you know, maybe he will be the nicer one. Who knows? He looks like a cool guy. <laughs> All right, get to know. Um, I don't even know. Um, let's try to be funny with him. A knock knock joke, and she's like so embarrassed. But like, you should go away, please. Go away. Go away. I'm sorry, dude. Please go. You were rude to us, and we're not gonna put up with that. All right, ask about career. So we're going to talk to him while he eats some yogurt. What? Ask about day. Go on. Alrighty. Um, compliment his outfit. And him, him and that other guy are very similar, so I mean, I guess we'll see if they get along. Um, get to know. He just stole that dude's yogurt. <laughs> Okay. Discuss interests. Um, flatter. 
sitting down with us. Oh yeah. Um. I don't even know. Get to know. Why is she embarrassed again? What's up with her? Knock knock joke. Tell a funny story. I don't know why she keeps getting embarrassed. But it's about to go away, so that's good. Um. Tell a joke about mimes. Awkward encounter. Okay, so he's ambitious. His name's Tate. Okay. Whenever I hear the name Tate, I think of the first season of American Horror Story. <laughs> it's the only season I ever watched. I tried to watch season two, and I was just like, no. I know some of you guys may love it and maybe like, maybe like hating me right now, but I don't know. I I guess I got attached to like the characters in season one, and I didn't like the fact that like the um. It's basically like a whole new story every season and like all the characters play different people and all that eh, I don't, I'm not really into that like I wanted it to continue because I got like attached to the characters and stuff like that so and the storyline and whatnot so <laughs> all right so we're gonna compliment his outfit again and he wants to cook but we're gonna like you know be all I don't even know clingy I guess not gonna let him cook. We're gonna talk to him. Ask about day. Um, bright and day. We can try, like, just to ask if he's single. And I hope he's cooking a group meal because she's hungry. If he's even gonna cook it. Alright, so he is single. Perfect. Um, did we already ask about your career? I have no idea. Um, deep conversation. Okay, so he's unemployed, so he needs to get that job, but <laughs> that's alright. Knock, knock joke. Um, let's try to hug him. See how that goes. So, they're definitely getting along better than this dude, because he's kind of an ass now. I don't know. <laughs> that was a weird laugh. Okay. Alrighty, so he's going back to cooking. So, I don't know. We're going to clean up this plate for him, or this bowl. Okay, so sadly, he only made one serving. We're gonna try to go steal it. Don't know if she can grab it in time. We're gonna try. Okay, awesome. So now he just gets some chips, and we get this like awesome like scrambled eggs, toast, bacon. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, deep conversation. Um, discuss interests. Heartfelt compliment. Um, knock knock joke. Ask about day. Um, bright and day. And let's just speed that up. So he's active. Cool, cool. Alright, so they're getting along a lot better, to be honest. Okay. Inside joke. Oh my gosh, he's all excited. <laughs> Compliment his appearance. Um, flatter him a little bit. Alright, so this one's romantic. Let's see if he's okay with that. I guess so. Awesome. Okay. Um, romance pickup line. Okay. I'm gonna have her. Br she's gonna come here and she is gonna go over there. Or wait. Come over here. And she is just gonna be so rude. Rude introduction. <laughs> because I feel like, okay, so like, I don't know. This is supposed to have like, you know, there's supposed to be drama, obviously, with the storyline. And. I feel like if she, if something makes her happy and if she like you know Aspen's like getting along with him like she wants to be an ass to him and like try to screw it up I don't know and make like him mad and then not want to you know be with her because they're living together and you know <laughs> all right so imply mother is a llama mock outfit um we're gonna insult him um, we're gonna lie about our career. Um, instill with false confidence? Okay. What are you doing? So you're gonna go read. You're kind of just staying away from this drama. She doesn't want to deal with it. She doesn't know what's wrong with her best friend and what is going on here. She's like, first of all, when we first moved into this house, you had blonde hair. You had light, girly pink makeup and you wore pretty dresses. What's going on with you? 
What has happened to your appearance? And why are you being so rude to everyone except me? Am I next? Are you gonna start being rude to me next? <laughs> okay. Um, we're gonna give fake bad news. Um, mock outfit, and then we're going to go to mischief and um invite to fake party. Jeer him a little bit. Um, we're gonna fight him, and Aston's gonna be like, "What the heck? <laughs> what are you doing?" She's just like, huh? Okay, so they despise each other just like that. And it's like really late, but they stay out late. Okay, so now she's gonna come over here. And she's actually going to go over here and um, we're gonna yell at her for fighting this guy that she likes. Cause she's not cool with that. And she's like, you're supposed to be my best friend. <laughs> All right, and then we are going to try to do a pickup line with Tate. See if, you know, that'll be okay since Jada's right there. Oh! What have you done? Okay, well, I take that as it's time to leave because he's angry. Okay, wait, but he, like, seems fine. This is, like, so confusing. Okay, bright and day. Smooth apology. Um, that dude's gonna pee his pants over there. <laughs> okay. So we're just gonna do those two things with him, and then I think we're gonna head home. Alright, so yeah, we're gonna go home now. Travel with Jada. And right now, Aspen's not too happy with Jada. And Jada's just like, what? I didn't do anything. <laughs> I'm just, I like to cause mischief. Alrighty. And I'm just gonna like take care of them and then they're gonna head to bed because it's really late and I'm pretty sure, I don't know, I have to check if Aspen has work, but if she does, she probably goes pretty early and she's gonna be really tired, so that sucks, but she had a good night before Jada came along and like caused a fight, but <laughs> okay. So she is just going to use the washroom and then go to bed and let me just check really quickly. Okay, she doesn't have work for three days, awesome. So she can actually sleep in. And I'm going to just have Jada come over here and have a quick meal of just some chips. And then she's going to go to bed. Alright, so she's going to go to sleep. And I think I'm going to end this part here, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and there was a little bit more drama. And yeah, I think that Aspen is better off with Tate. Um... Let me know what you guys think, but I don't know. I guess I thought that Seth was good, but then when she saw him again, they just weren't getting along very well, and yeah, <laughs> he was kind of like rude. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this part, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.